And the card attached would say, thank you for being a friend. Let me tell you that I was savage. Jersey. Previously with Peyton. The fact that I order stuff off Amazon and I literally forget what I order. Like, I could have just ordered it yesterday. What is this? Now we gotta be doing like this again. Thank God for the day. Today is beautiful. Today is uh, the day that the Lord has made. No, you've been hoping and praying. Cause I've been right here and I heard every word you were saying. You've been complaining about who did it, baby, and do you need saving? Shop around first. I know you can find those same bed sheets for cheaper. And I did. On Amazon. Because a lot of these perfume perfumers are friends and they be like, oh, that smell good. Put a little bit in my bottle. You really just buying the bottle. If you haven't checked out that vlog, definitely go and check it out. That is part one. Now let's get into part two of Quita's birthday weekend and see what's going on. All right, sis. You see I got my collar shirt on. That's some, um, I mean business. I'm sitting in my office. That means I mean business. We getting into it. We making sure all business is taken care of. We opening businesses. And we making sure our homes are protected. Our cars are protected. Our life is protected. And that's why I want to introduce you guys to Lemonade. And thank Lemonade for sponsoring today's video. And if you guys did not know about Lemonade, Lemonade is on a mission to simplify your life with insurance so insurance does not have to suck okay because i know there are people out there that are against insurance but what i want you to know is there's a simple and easy way to get all the coverage you need in one place with lemonade lemonade is the insurance for simplicity ultimate speeds and affordable prices the main advantages are super fast and simple sign up mobile first customizable coverage coverage that offers peace of mind and renter's insurance coverage that starts at $5 a month. The claims and reimbursement is 100% digital and any unclaimed money goes to a charity of your choice as the policyholder. Pet insurance get money back on vet bills and your renter's insurance belongings are covered away from your home. The things renters love about Lemonade is the right coverage, the right pricing, the right way, and the right cost. The sign up process is super easy. All you have to do is go to Lemonade.com backslash Peyton and you get to see what's covered and what's not covered. Now Lemonade was so gracious to provide me with a special link. So all you guys have to do is go to Lemonade.com backslash Peyton. Click the link in my description box to go ahead and sign up and make sure you get everything that you need. One stop shop, set it and forget it. And thanks again to Lemonade for sponsoring today's video. <laughs> to another weekly vlog me and quita today is sunday sunday fun day me and quita are um on the rooftop she is geeked to put this um fire pit together so tonight we can like come out on the rooftop and like drink and stuff so we are about to attempt to put this fire to get fire pit like it's already together we are about to attempt to um, hook up the propane tank. I don't know about you, but I'm a little scared. I've been saying that I was gonna get a professional to come out here and do it. And I still, 
I know you a professional, but I'm saying I was just telling them that I had been procrastinating. Oh, I got you. Okay, here you These go. shears for your hair. Yeah, I know. Okay, let me go get some real sales of steam. And I think, I, I, I want to say, I didn't even put the battery in there right because I didn't want it to be able to die. Yeah. So, okay, check that while I'm taking this off. I want to make sure I do not put no type of hole. I don't remember. There we go. I don't remember. What the instructions is? Cause I don't even remember how I put the battery in there, child. It's been so long ago. Oh, I'm sorry. What? The um stuff line to it. Oh shit! Let me stop trying to unwrap that piece of paper. <clears throat> it's okay. Oh, okay. You just you just screw it off. Okay, so you want to check and make sure the batteries in there, correct? Yeah, I, and I ain't even bring the right batteries. This is a double A. It's supposed to be triple A. Triple A, but yeah, you see, I ain't even take the packaging off. I ain't okay. even put it in there Perfect. right, so. Okay. Because I mean, I knew it, I wouldn't be able to use it until it was installed. Hmm. Okay. In the case you need. So I'm gonna go ahead and put it in right now. Okay. Let me go blow my damn out. So the plus side. Okay. I think I'm gonna get these strip lights. Off of Amazon, I think I'm about to get these and do my kitchen. And if I like them in the kitchen, because they motion sensor, if I like them in the kitchen, then I'm gonna um, redo my closet and put them in my closets. They got some. Like they got some motion sensor strip lights. So the ones that I got, you see, are those just look little, little one little. They be falling and that shit annoying as hell but these supposed to like just stick i'm telling you you're gonna like them um i got some in my kitchen underneath my counters mm -hmm. and you you, you like did them. the stick the strip but okay. um the only thing is i just didn't get mine from amazon i went to like home depot or lowe's or something like that and I, that's why i got mine okay. but this was a few years ago this was back when covid had first hit so i went in the store and got it that's all okay <clears throat> Um, you put the battery in, correct? Mm-hmm. Okay. We might need to make, wait five minutes for the gas to dissipate. Okay. And then, while we pressing this, we turn, turn this. this. That's what I was trying to see if I had instructions. It was so perfect. Ignited. All right. Do I need safety glasses? Man, cause we ain't trying to look like fire marshal good around that bitch. Let me tell you something. <laughs> <laughs> Are we gonna be able to see it though? Keep going, keep going. You was it on low. Keep going. Yeah, oh, keep, go, so oh. yeah, keep going to the left. Like mm -hmm. there you go, bitch. I'm the professional. It went out. Yep, so keep time. So I say keep time. You see this where it say low? You want to keep turning this. Okay. So once you ignite it, keep turning. And then if it go out again, I might need to open the valve a little more on the propane. Yep, keep going. Yep, keep turning. There we go. Keep turning. Keep but turning the knob. Keep turning the knob. That's as much as you turn. Okay. We did that, friend. Ooh, that heat feel good. Oh, okay, now I can turn more. Yeah. Fire oh, Marshal Bill. Probably just, you know, because it's Oh sweet. my God. We did that, but it's going to look real pretty tonight. Oh my God. 
I couldn't believe you ain't had this hooked up. That's what I'm like. Girl, oh, I was we, so fucking scared I'm like, to do this by this myself. Up. I'm like, we hooking this up. Y'all, look, Quita came and helped me connect my fire pit. It's the professional for me. It, it's the professional. You know what I'm saying? Because bitches from Sheffield are definitely smart. Don't get it twisted. It is. And it is. No child left behind. No child left behind the fuck. <laughs> It, it follows me better when I don't flip it around to do selfie. Mm. Hi guys. So we're on the gimbal again today. Me and Quita Quita are getting ready to go and indulge in um, Sunday fun day. So we're about to go in upstairs and find us something to wear. What you in the mood for? What you mean as far as what? Attire. What you, what you going for? Oh yeah, warm. definitely warm. <laughs> yeah, we went out last night and the people. We, oh, we're not gonna say the girls. <laughs> <laughs> Baby, the people was they thought it was still summertime last week. shy. They thought it was summertime shy. They had to because um we was the only aunties fully dressed. Like I ain't no auntie. I ain't either. But I'm just saying. Baby, we went in look, looking like we had money, not like we, we gave was trying rich, to prove we something. Got we Bodies definitely fully gave covered. rich bitch vibes. We mm -hmm. definitely gave it off. Because the people that we seen, the people we seen last night, like, they they sick right now. They need some night cooler definitely tonight. The sniffles. They, they, definitely they need the sniffles. some, I swear, they need some <coughs> Doing this all rope. day, yep. <coughs> Why my throat scratchy? Bitch, you ain't have on no motherfucking clothes last night. Sandals. Sandals. It was 45. Sandals. No jacket. Shorts, no jacket. Short shorts. Short, short, short no. ass dresses. Oh. They thought it was summertime shy. They had to. I feel like an auntie sitting here talking about them, honestly. Cause we were standing in line like now. I know they cold because we got on we got on trench coat and boots. Hello! And was still cold. This still coming My from teeth were doing it. Coming from two anemic motherfuckers, but still. <laughs> <laughs> still. Shit. Yeah, covered. It was cold. Yeah, what you wearing? Covered. Yep. Warmth. I ain't, I ain't got shit to prove. Listen, I'm finna put on some baggy jeans. Probably like a little bustier, but a, a, a nice warm coat that's gonna cover that up. Hello, somebody. You look, you can see my face and my hair. That's all you need to know. You feel me? Hmm. That's all you need to know. Hmm. The neck work. Hmm. And I have my foot on necks. Bad. <laughs> Dun, 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 you know what? Dun, dun. She still ain't called me back. Let me come up here with you. I want to see what you want. Okay. Okay, now we back with the regular tripod. So this is what I was thinking. My homegirl, she a YouTuber. She sent me these pants. Tierra Monet. These pants. This bustier. And then <clears throat> this coat is really big. Ooh, that's so pretty. But this that aviator. Is so pretty. What Jackie, it just stink though. Manier Duvoir, like Manier Duvoir usually don't have like odors. But that jacket, that aviator jacket smells a little fishy. I got a US size six. Why is this coat so big? It's huge. So what you think you needed like a four? I think that fits you good. This motherfucker is huge, is it not? Mm-mm. I think it fits you perfect. It looked like it's supposed to be a little oversized. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's cute on. When I think about you. Yeah, cause girls is players too. Uh. 
yeah, yeah, cause girls is players too. My heart's still feels bad. We just get money all around the world. I've been using this angled brush to clean up my eyebrows these past couple of days and I really like it. So I'm going to take Quita to um, Dallas Social. We trying to get there in a good amount of time, like before nine, because they're kind of funny at the door at that place. They're funny at the door. There have been quite a few times where I have went and I have been with someone and they act funny at the door. So like when I go out by myself, I don't have any of these issues. When I'm with somebody, Oh my God, they always act funny. Now, if it's a girl, if I'm gonna, like they always act like they eat capacity. I don't know what they be, but they always act like they eat capacity that they can't let nobody in. This is why I like getting cool with the people at the door, like the guys at the door. I like getting cool with them, but not cool to the point where, okay, now you got a crush on me. Cause then it never works like I just I'm just nice like I just like being nice so and you see me I, you know I frequent the place I'm always by myself like you know what I'm saying you fuck with me like that just because of you know courtesy rapport if you will but uh. Like, back in my makeup days, y'all, I used to, like, like playing with different eye looks. But now, girl, give me a brown lid and call it a day. It creates a nice shadow. It gives your eyelid a nice amount of color. But it's not, like, doing too much. You know what I'm saying? Cause the, tr the, the key is to trick men into thinking that you just have good skin and some lashes on, okay? That's what it's all about. You just got good skin and some lashes on. That way, when he wake up in the morning next to you, he not expecting to wake up next to this freaking Barbie doll that he met under the club lights last night. When he roll over, he's like, damn. She even more gorgeous, sleep with no makeup on. Like you, you want a nigga to wake up and cuddle up under you. You know what I'm saying? Not wake up and sneak out. All right. Same as always. Last night I powder con contoured. I think today I'm gonna cream. Never, I never put the cream contour under my lip, but I, I see girls doing it, so I'm gonna see what effect this does. Cause I really don't understand the purpose of it. Is it supposed to like make your lips look plumper when you do that? Like, what's tea? Like, I love this so much. I would totally like just mix this with though with a sunscreen and make it a BB cream. Like they could totally do that with this foundation. Like NARS could come out with this like, I don't know, call this something else cause people just really don't gravitate towards BB creams like that. Like BB cream just, I remember when BB creams came out and it was a thing for a short period of time but I just really don't feel like people just really like fuck with BB creams like that. 
they should i think it was really just another way to like profit off of selling a new product because when like the beauty industry kind of like really took off i feel like brands felt like you had to be coming out with something new to stay like relevant you had to keep coming out with something new every season and when one makeup company would do something another makeup company would do it like y'all remember when highlighters was a thing and like everybody was addicted to highlighters so everybody like all these different makeup brands started coming out with all these different highlighters oh my god i had like a drawer full of fucking highlighters all pretty much the same color it was ridiculous like the highlighter scam that was probably one of the best scams because that shit was really just shimmer eyeshadow in a bigger pot but they sold it as oh it's gonna make your cheeks pop and it's gonna make your skin look all dewy and we're gonna charge you 40 fucking dollars for this huge eyeshadow pot and well foundations <laughs> That is a whole nother scam, okay? Whole nother. But we're not gonna get into that because I am a foundation junkie. So, can I really call it a scam if I have been scammed and I have allowed it? Can I really call it a scam? Probably not. Cream blushes, let's be real. This is lipstick. This is lip shit, lipstick melted down into a palette. We are putting lipstick on our cheeks. How do I know? Because they have lip and cheek stains. So that exposed the scam. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. Now I will be honest. Not all setting powders are created equal. Because the love that I have for Hourglass setting powder. So I'm doing my hair before I do my lips because my hair is going to tell me what lips I want to wear. Last night we were matte. Today we will be glossy. Glossy and flossy. Today. Okay, so first I'm going to line my lips with 1119 Cosmetics Lip Liner. I met her too. She's so cute. I met her and her mom and her sister. Her and her mama look like sisters. The mama actually like she younger. She could eat their little sister. Good James. Mama got some good ass Jane. She looks so young. She was like, my daughter sent you that 1119 jacket. I said, daughter? She how old is your daughter? Six? Baby daughter grown. Scared me half the deal. This is Juvia's Juvia's Place Cosmetics in the shade Lady. You're my lady. You're my lady. Ooh, it's the perfect nude. Perfect nude for me. I got a lot of compliments on this lip combo last night too. I'm gonna go in with this lip gloss and you can get this from Bath and Body Works. Very inexpensive, but very good. It's gonna give you this shine, girl. It's gonna give you shine and a nice plump. 
Okay, outfit is on. It is so cute. It came out so good. Okay, so what are we gonna put on tonight? So I bathed in another 13 body wash that I got from Le Labo yesterday in um, the previous vlog. And I really wanna wear another 13, but chances are since we're going to Dallas Social and you can smoke inside of the club, I'm probably going to light up and this just does not mask the smoky smell after I smoke like my other scents. This is just, I mean, but if I wanna, <laughs> listen, another 13, you are that bitch. I'm not telling you that you don't do what you're supposed to do because you do it. Okay, you do it. Oh, we ain't wore Gris Chanel Extra Eat. We have not worn this in a while. You know we just bought Gris Chanel. Look at the, it's it's autographed. I feel special. We have not worn this in a while now. We can pop out with this. But we also got some new babies. We got some new babies. We got that mind game blockade. This motherfucker right here. <laughs> okay, yeah, this is what we're doing. We're doing this. Yeah, we're totally, yeah, yeah. It's mango in it, you know, it's a little fruity. I will say that the nozzle, I'm not that impressed with the nozzle on this one. It sprays on like a freaking setting spray. Like I need it to burst. Like, I need it to be a burst of greatness, okay? A burst. And yes, I'm over spraying because I'm gonna smoke. I'm definitely gonna smoke. All right, this is tonight's outfit. Super, super cute. Where is everything from? So, the bustier is from Micah's. The, um,. Camo pants are from 1130. These are Tierra Monet. She's a YouTuber as well. This is from her clothing brand. The bag is Jacku Moose. Christian Louboutin, so Kate. And then the hair is Z Monet. I cut this wig into a bob. It used to be longer. Last year when I wore the red hair, it was a long um, wig and I cut it into a bob. Shop Gold Cuban Fendi necklace also wearing the matching earrings the fendi earrings ray got me these um as well and then my jbw watch as well as some shop link and live pieces and then we're gonna put on our aviator jacket with that i need to spray that bad boy down with perfume too because it smells very fishy but I love, when I tell y'all I love these pants, they sold out. Baby, they one and done, so you're not going to be able to get them. But I love these pants. I just love, like, how they kind of sculpture the inner, the inseam. I love that. So, it kind of make you look a little bow-legged. Because <laughs> y'all know how I feel about bow-legged people. And then we put the jacket on. So, probably... Cause the sleeves smell really fishy. I might just do this number with it. Mm -hmm. The sleeves smell really fishy. So like I, I don't want to stick my arm in the sleeve and then take my sleeve off, which I probably won't even be doing tonight, honestly. Um, but inside of the jacket, it just smells really fishy. But this is the look. Let me get the bag. This is the look.
Look at me, where she wanna be Call me Freaky T, off the leash I feel like a dog, I can't have the flea Keep it P, never needed you But you needed me I got cream, make a pretty clean Who's push your self-esteem I, I get tight in the moment So I feel like Baby King Fuss is black, step on something So I just like Baby D Bitch, I'm cold, pussy ass I'm that you know it's giving cream I got hoes, when it's not enough Come feel the nigga team Um, yeah, Jack. Fuck. Oh, wait. How a minute. you love to um? How the hell? Okay. Home. Home. Yup. We got three minutes to quit a birthday. My fortieth PayPal's. Fourteenth. I like that better. Fourteenth. <laughs> Fourteenth. How old? How old were we when we met? Twelve. We met seventh grade. Yeah, seventh grade. Then I left. We went back to Chicago. We came back. No, I think I met you the second time around because we moved. Eighth there. grade or ninth grade? So maybe it was the second time. It was. The Did we meet time. the first year we became cheerleaders? We met then, or were we uh -uh. already cool? We met. The we met before then. Nope. We met after cheerleaders. After no. we had already made the squad. You know what no, I'm saying? No, we was friends when we tried out. All of us was friends. Yep, me and Wayne Quito. Ooh, child. Yeah, we yep, was friends we was already. already friends. Yep, we I, was friends. We met in the seventh grade, Quito. Right, and that's what I'm saying. Like, I, so, the situation when I was talking to you about earlier, remember? I got a bad-ass memory, but I remember that. <laughs> we met in the seventh grade. I, right. So I know we came there. Remember, I was telling you earlier we came there once to visit. Then once we came there to live, we left. We went back to Chicago, and that was eighth grade. That was my eighth grade. So this, what, listen. what is this man right here doing? With? Girl, playing with a soccer ball. Oh shit! Cause I saw him scratching and itching. I'm like, oh yeah. lord. Yeah, girl. All of my friends before seventh grade were like white and Asian. So, I don't know where it was. It was 8th grade. Happy birthday! Damn, that three minutes went by fast. Fast as hell. Happy birthday! Happy birthday. Thank you, friend. Ah, 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 ah. Look like DJ Chow. Hey, hey come on, friend. Hey. I know what to do. Too much be a sad. Hey, I heard this song. Really? The words way. Head down, yeah. You gonna have the words today. It's a, it's a, it's a fucking bird. <clears throat> All right, hey, we getting ready to go to a spa castle. This is my first time coming to spa castle, and um, I'm taking Quita for her birthday. We're getting massages today, but like they have so much stuff to do here. They you get you can do manicures, pedicures, facials, body scrubs, all of that. And it's also inside of a hotel. It's pretty nice. Why? Because you said we was gonna get pedicures. Oh, uh, that's yeah. that's gonna be uh somewhere else. We'll probably do that tomorrow. What that? together so we just get fully undressed and we're getting Swedish massages let me be I wants to be got to be sugar mama 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 yeah. sugar mama okay yeah we're getting ready to go to dinner but we are running late so this is what I'm wearing you guys have seen it before I'll give you the details when we get back we're running late let me be I wants to be got to be I feel like a pimp <laughs> feel like the man Ready,
Good morning. I am getting ready to go to get um the crowd facial. I usually go at two, but my two o'clock appointment was taken, so I had to up it to one o'clock. So me and Quita are about to go there and um and then after that gonna get some lunch and then go get our toes done it's raining and cold and i want to do all of this stuff but she leaves tomorrow so and she down for it as long as we don't get sick y'all the funniest thing <clears throat> you know i when i first moved in here i packed everything that i knew that was gonna be in cabin room i put it in cabin room and then i kind of use her closet as an overflow storage space um until like you know she moves back and then um so i put like this basket of like hair stuff that i had in my old apartment and um i hadn't looked at that basket looked in that basket since i moved in here uh, november was it no it was october 2021 right it's raining outside i said i know it's an umbrella in this house i think it's an umbrella in that basket it was so my memory isn't as bad as i say it is i just it's just things that i choose not to remember i guess i guess i repress certain memories and certain memories i like traumatic memories oh baby i'll never forget those i'm taking those to the, to, to, the, to the grave that's that's why i hold grudges i think people that don't hold grudges they have a bad a, a bad memory you going with me the fuck yeah and it is this how we gonna be when we when <laughs> when we get old too and it is I th she thought she was gonna leave me y'all i'm getting ready to go i'm getting ready to go to piccadilly <laughs> You want to go with me? And is. <laughs> Look, I brought the oil today. What kind of oil is this? Olay, Jojoba, Jojoba, Jehovah. Jehovah. I'm so sick of this shit. I don't never pronounce nothing right. We know you. Fuck, fuck that. Who cares? The people in the comments, because they going to correct me. It's Jehovah. Jehovah, Jehovah, Oba. Herbs, herbs, all that shit. They gonna what put else? the they gonna put the pronunciation, how to break it down, and actually say it Girl, and everything, baby. They ain't gonna let me miss. Like we just can't go to fucking Google and say pronounce. <laughs> they ain't gonna let me miss. Thank you, English majors. <laughs> <laughs> and what's so crazy? I got a minor in English. Don't tell nobody else that. Okay. <laughs> Don't you tell nobody else that. I know how to speak properly. I always say this. Listen, it's not, it really ain't even code switching to me. I know how to speak properly. I can speak properly. I do in certain environments. My thing is, I'm grown, bitch. Who gonna check me? But this how I talk. Who gonna check me? I've been talking like this ever since I was a little ass girl. Like this you how I never, talk. Now, one thing I can say, you ain't never switched up on me. Not ever. Mm -mm. Out of all the time I've been knowing you, never. Yeah, this how she talk, and is, and what you say, and what about it? Yeah, I ain't, I ain't on that old uh, Kanye and Michael Jackson shit. Well, Michael Jackson always had like a little soft-spoken voice, but Kanye was very on, much Chicago. We ain't finna go back on my. Oh yeah. Kanye. <laughs> Kanye was very much Chicago in the beginning. Now Kanye speaks like a Kardashian. And I'm not going to, you know, I'm not saying anything derogatory about the way he speaks. He speaks with, you know, he has great vernacular. But that's not how he talk because that's definitely not how he rap. But the one thing I can say is Kanye West has been very always very fucking educated he was a lame he was a goofy he was a nerd growing up in chicago like kanye went out there in them streets kanye not kanye ain't the little dirks or the king bonds he ain't never rapped about no stuff no, like he that a mama's you know boy he was a mama's boy mm -hmm. he still is a mama's boy yeah that's why my guy fucked up out here in these streets <laughs> Pretty much. Damn, yo, yo, it's the feds, friend. Honestly, I feel like my neck look better in person than it do on camera. This camera be really accentuating. 
my lines in my neck but this is I'm getting ready to do the third session this is what my neck looking like as you can see this is this where that little lump is it's going down a lot but I ain't gonna get ahead of myself I'm not gonna get ahead of myself and and say that it's working we just on treatment three but this is what this is what I want my neck to look like no lines but more than anything I wanted this little lump I don't know what this I don't know if it's a tr it's, it's um because you know sometimes when you get um surgery the fluid from lipo gets trapped in your lymph nodes yep <laughs> and it's and it's no way for it to come out at all it's it's like it turns into a cyst or something yep have you ever tried just constantly massaging it rubbing it to see if you can possibly let that fluid get that fluid to no not constantly i'm not consistent I'm with very much <laughs> you consistent with you too this makes me money Girl, if it don't make me no Buddy. money, I ain't gonna be consistent with it. As you can see, I ain't got no nigga. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Mike, Mike, keep one if look, Mike, Mike keep, keep one if it Mike keep some money. one if it made me some money. <laughs> that pimping, that pimping right there. <laughs> I'm not fucking with you. Like my skin is glowing. It's looking so good. It's doing so good. I think the the facials weekly are helping. All right, guys, me and Quita Quita are in at home because I want to organize my pantry. I'm gonna show it to y'all when we get back to the house. It looks a little bad. It look a little bad, I ain't gonna lie. It'll have you confused on what's uh, edible and, and what's expired. I ain't, I ain't gonna lie, I have cookies in there that's probably from 15, 19, no, Sicily. Sicily, Sicily. <laughs> 1983. You, cr you crunch down to them cookies and you be like, I don't know about these, babe. We might need to throw these away. It's, 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 it can be embarrassing. I feel like I'm about to spend $200 in here. Them beans high as hell. Let's go over in the kitchen. How much I eat one of those white ones? $7.99. Mm -hmm. So that's fourteen together. Mm hmm This this is seventeen. That's not gonna fit in the cabinet that I needed to go in. Oh, These gonna you think fit about it because it's, it's, it's real. It's, yeah, it's okay. real small. Let's see how much is this turntable. Let's see how much is this turntable. Oh my God, this is twenty six dollars. Get me At out of here! Did not used to be this much, child. Get me out of here. Stuff. Like those underneath these risers, mm -hmm. and then your um, you will be able to see everything. Cause if everything is all on the same level, you know what I mean. Like, yeah, you want to be able to see all your food, but not this particular. They got some clear ones that they look like this, but they're not this big either. But they clear with a flat top. The it's not rigid. Those. Like this. Those white ones cool because the inside of the pantry white. Yeah, but I'm looking for something. Um, the top looks like this of this that I'm looking for. Mm. It's smooth so it'll easily sit. You know what I'm saying? Sit right on top. I just had deja vu. Really? And what would they be in the store? Yeah, I totally had a dream about this. Totally. Y'all, if y'all want suitcases, come to Burlington, okay? They're more than just great coats, okay? Come to Burlington. Look at these suit suitcase prices. Nice. 
challenge. How, how Mr. Bean be walking? So my last set was a rose gold set. I think I want to get another rose gold set. Oh, look at this suitcase. Which one you want? I know I, know I didn't need them. I was going to um, get that one. Oh, you gotta leave me, friend. I oh, know. Yeah, that inside nice. Mm -hmm. I think there's a like a blackberry type of interior. That's nice. I, Cause I like it how this, it met the interior, the steering wheel matched the uh, interior too. I like that. I think it's the mm -hmm. only one I like that where it has the. Um, it's like monochromatic. The steering wheel Go back the same a little as bit. the seats. Did I tell you BMW text me and said the battery cell came in? Mm -hmm. They could have started working on the car. No. So they mm -hmm. text, text you me. today. He texted me today. Yep. Doo -doo -doo. What the fuck? Well, where did he need to go? Hmm. Oh no. Damn, am I tripping? Was that a dream? <laughs> Girl, not a dream. No, no, nothing. I'm not fucking with you. <laughs> Did Girl, the people text you? <laughs> I could have sworn. I could have sworn. Have I took a nap today? <laughs> no. Okay, here you go. It's a, yeah, it was today. It's okay. 456. I'm, I don't have his number say. Okay. Lord. <laughs> it's a, hey, it's Ryan at BMW Dallas. I have good news. The battery cell came in today. We are going to start work tomorrow. So what's tomorrow? tomorrow Thursday? Uh-huh. So my car should be ready next week. Hmm. Mm-hmm. My car should be ready next week. Which is fine because <clears throat> I don't think my um my new car gonna be here until the summertime. I wouldn't mm. wanna be in a loner for six months any damn way. When a person posts a new photo to their story. Nude? New. <laughs> Oh, okay. N E W. Okay. <laughs> Today's story. When you scrolling and you see people's photos, I mean not photos. You see like they story on IG. You know what I'm talking about? Mm -hmm. Not at the top, but mm -hmm. like in the middle. Mm -hmm. Does it show that last photo that the person posted? Wait, wait. Say it again. Say it again. So like, <clears throat> let me go to Instagram and show you what I'm talking about. So like, say for instance, these were people's stories. Uh -huh. Does it show the last, like if you click here instead of clicking up here to see the person's story? What the fuck? Is she naked? I don't know, friend. I wasn't even looking at that. She naked? You follow her? Who is this? Hold on. Oh, let me take a screenshot of this so we can go back. How the fuck she make a reel getting in a jacuzzi naked? I can't even upload a fucking reel of me know. reenacting a drunk you, person. I need you to focus on what I'm saying. Because <laughs> that, that, that's not what I'm saying. Right here. Say, for instance, these are people's stories. Do you see the last, can you see the last photo that a person posts? 
damn, look at this uh, fried cabbage. I said I was going to make some fried mm -hmm. cabbage with smoked turkey necks. ADHD. 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 Hold on, real really? quick though. I done had them smoked uh, turkey turkey necks in the refrigerator for about a week and a half. Can well, I still come on. eat them? What's the best buy date? <laughs> Let's see. Shit, nah, what's this growing on it? I think it's something growing on it. Girl, let me see. Damn. Yes, ma'am. Throw that shit away. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. <laughs> that, yes. Don't put it in there. Oh, okay. You're taking out more. It was okay. on top of some asparagus. Might as well throw that away, too, because shit. Child. Asparagus probably gone bad right with it. What's Damn. the best about date? Okay, you said do a show they last picture that they posted. The last. I don't think so. Y'all, earlier today, me and Quita was in, uh, the, we was in Burlington. We was going in Burlington looking at some luggage because she wanted to buy some, another suitcase so she could fit her boots in that I got her. With the with box. The box. And so as we walking in, I see this white lady and I'm really looking at the way she walking, baby, because man was putting on a show. You didn't see baby, it. I did. I baby, did. She was, was like, she ba baby, she was, she was like switching. Was like, she was switching some series, baby. She was putting on a show. You know, I didn't notice that she was white at first. And then when like she turned her head, I saw that it was a white lady. So I was like, oh, I like your dreads. Here go Quita. Locks. I'm like, that's the same damn thing. And she's like, what you say? Them folks named them dreads because they called our hair dreadful. So white people, European people, called locks dreadful. So that's why you call them. That's why certain people call them dreads. But they're actually locks. Even Medusa, the snakes on her head, they were actually locks. They were not snakes. Little history lesson. But what the motherfuckers called? They called dread call, locks, mm, though. No, they're just called locks. Man, all my life, but, I, all my but, life, I had to fight, and them motherfuckers was called like dread locks. Dreadful locks. Because we ain't know no better. Well, she said thank you. And I said fool. <laughs> I said fool. Because her in her mind, she probably think, oh, I got a compliment by some black girls who call my dreads cute. Most people who have locks call them dreads if you want to. Watch this. You could have called somebody. Yep. Watch this. Watch this. What's up, old lady? Happy belated. Oh, Shut Lord, your ass no, up. He What's did. up, baby? <laughs> Thank you. I got a question. I got a question. I'm talking to my homegirl. We having a debate. Man. Go ahead. Happy New Year, baby. Happy New Year. <laughs> Happy New Year. This ain't no debate. And thank you. And thank you. Well, we're having a discussion. If it if uh, somebody in the street passed you and said, I like your dreads. What would you say? Thank you. No. Hold on. No, ain't no no. Ain't no no. Ain't no no. See, now you. Hold on. Wait, wait. Stop. Wait. Yeah, it's, yeah, yeah. It's, it's, it depends. Okay, it depends. It depends on what? And, it depends on what and why? You don't. Thank you. So, so sometimes I don't feel like going through that with people. Some people, it ain't even worth explaining. Explain. You don't want to explain that shit to them. Yeah. But some yeah, people, you break it down to them, when, right? When, when AJ said dreads before, I, I corrected him. You know? Right, you correct your people. You correct that's your like, people. That's like somebody coming up to me and being like, oh, I like your wig. Everybody don't want to hear that. You right. Everybody don't want to hear it. You right. You right. 
You right. Everybody don't want to hear that. You right. You right. You right. Everybody don't want to hear that. My name enlightened for a reason. So you right. Let me stop it. You right. <laughs> Let me stop it. That's like, that's like, <laughs> that's like me saying, me getting mad because somebody saying, oh, I like your wig, your wig cute, instead of saying your hair cute. I could get a few. Yeah, you would, look, you would look past hair it if hair. I said it, but that's why I Why not I, just say your I hair is cute? And you know what I'm saying? Why you got to point out that I got on a wig? But who cares? It's a compliment. Why did Don't I make say a problem it? out right. of a compliment. That's why I changed it. I said, who say it? You know what I'm saying? Say what? Who don't? Hey, y'all. Good morning. I smell amazing. So me and Quita are getting ready to go to, um, have brunch. And then after that, we're going to go to the gun range. And then after that, I'm taking her to the airport. She's leaving today. She cried last night. I was all sad. Because quiet as guilt. I like being alone. But when I'm with her, I don't know. It just seemed like this how it's supposed to be. You know what I'm saying? Like, everybody else, like, annoy me. I be ready, like, try at least two days. But I'm not ready for her to leave either. So, today's scent of the day, because I knew I was going to need, need to be extra happy. Today's scent of the day, I tried that combo that Nikki had on at the um, RBE ball that I went to in Florida with the gowns. Um, I have on... YSL Libra. I'm sorry, y'all. I had a little brain, brain situation. <clears throat> so I have on um, YSL Libra layered with Zara's Red Temptation. So sh her combo was Z uh, YSL Libra layered with Baccarat Rouge 540. But because I'm like low on that and it smells very similar to the zara's red temptation it's not exactly the same but it smells similar i layered it with uh, zara's red temptation instead and <sighs> listen amazing it's is it's quite amazing okay that is a great combo so if you have the zara red temptation and the ysl libre which i'm sure you do because all of the girls talked about ysl libre in 2020 and 2021 enough that you should have it by now child so layer those combo those together and tell me what you think and how you like it um you could also layer it with baccarat rouge as well but i layered it with red temptation um today because we're just going to brunch and then going to the gun range after that. So, um, I'm kind of, maybe I'm trying to save it. I'm trying to save my little back of rouge. Cause I didn't realize the back of rouge was so expensive. Like, I don't know. I think the first time I might've got it on after pay with Twisted Lily or something. Cause back of rouge, 300 and some dollars. And it's the girl, you know, it's, it's definitely one of the girls. But child, I don't know. The longevity on Baccarat Rouge, for, for me, I need to be able to smell my perfume when I wear it. Like, yeah, I love that everybody else can smell it and I like projection and things like that. But I want to be able to smell how good I smell. Because I like telling myself I smell good all day. Oh, and update. Oh, I already update y'all. I was going to update y'all on my car. They're starting work on my car today. So they have had my car for almost three months and they have not touched it. It's just been sitting up at the dealership in the um, shop. But they have not touched it. They Because it is a computer, you know what I'm saying? It's an electric vehicle. They have to get permission from BMW north america um uh, to run a test on it so they got the permission last week and now this week they got the battery in the battery cell because you know the whole floor of the car is a battery so they got the particular battery cell that's defective that now they can actually start work on it but i don't know how the hell they gonna fix that battery because if the floor of the car is the battery don't that mean you gotta take the car apart 
to put that one cell in like I don't know about that like I, I need a little bit more information but anyway um, I checked my email and lo and behold was a um, email from BMW North America the guy that actually reached out and told me that my car was recalled and could possibly blow up um, he emailed me letting me know that he's cutting another check for $1,200 um as a courtesy for the inconvenience and i thought that that was very sweet even though i have already um ordered a new vehicle but i thought that, that was very sweet you know what i'm saying like goodwill you know what i'm saying um but at the same time is that money because i have to wait another three months to get my car or you're simply just sending me a check because I have been waiting and I haven't caused any issues. Yeah, the reason why I ain't caused no issues is because after the first 30 days, I was already picking another car. Somebody come in and said, not Peyton treating her cars like she treat men. <laughs> Last day. I know. I'm gonna cry. I ain't gonna cry again. Been crying. Oh my shit. For real? <laughs> yeah, girl. Like even when I think about it. Like this was peace that I needed. That I wanted. Like, even peace without your dog. Even yep. though you missed him, you just yep. really got some good rest and peace. Yep. I had a dream about him last night, motherfucker. Uh-uh. Damn. This is what I want to say to you. <clears throat> Thank you for being a friend. Do, 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 do. Travel down the road and back do, again. Do, 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 do. Your heart is true. You're a pal and a confidant. Do, 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 do. And if you threw a party, invited everyone you knew. His gift would be from you and the card attached would say thank you for being a friend. Cause they still mad about the boost bitch. <laughs> he mad. He mad. Why is he mad about the damn boots? So um. I told you he asked me what did I want for my birthday and I really couldn't think of nothing that I wanted for my birthday but of course you know me and you know I like freaking shoes you know what I'm saying so you knew what to get me and so he was like oh I ain't coming to, to, to the airport on time you had to get a whole new suitcase cause to, for your boots and then <laughs> 7 o'clock this morning being petty friend oh, 7 o'clock no. this morning acting a fool I'm like oh He's still feeling some type of way about these little boots, baby. <laughs> it's funny as hell. <laughs> Not seven baby, in the morning. Seven in the morning. I he said, gonna be there waiting. Yeah, he is. <laughs> first thing he gonna say, you you let me know first thing. So let me see these I'm boots. Ready. And he is. And then, I baby. feel like he gonna say so. Let me see these boots. Soon as y'all get to the house, and I'ma whip them hoes out on. Now watch me whip. <laughs> watch me, <laughs> That's why I got them in the it the the side of the suitcase that I have them on in my big suitcase. When I say nothing on that side but them boots, I'ma bust open that zip, king. Fuck em. <laughs> Here they go. <laughs> We are here at DFW Gun Range and Academy. We're about to go in here and look at some guns and um, hopefully shoot. Do a little, you know, pew, 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 pew. Y'all feel me? Y'all, this combo smells so good. Uh -uh, I'm definitely, I'm definitely, it's like the entrance up here. Oh, damn. I'm definitely I'm gonna have to wear this more often. It projects really well, too. Well, damn, I saw... I'm sorry. It said entrance right above, like, you ain't see it. 
You ain't see it. No. I saw that. Ah. This is just the regular 365. Yep, that's what I wanted to see. So this one we have for rent. Not for sale? Not for sale. Really? Um, but this, you said you wanted to try to shoot. Yep, you want to show yeah, the, the main difference is going to be the little bit of the size because the this one's got a compensator on it. Quit a game in an X right for the gun. So see how it's got an integrated She's compensator a gun right there? Girl. So the recoil, the gases will be pushed up so the recoil has less. It's not going to kick back so hard, but that's why I want to practice and the shoot gas with The gas pushes out of, the, out of the top of the compensator and it'll push it down a little bit more than where that just kicks back. And which one is this? It's just another one, just uh, another compensator, scene. yeah. It's another 365. Okay. Um, it's not the I'm macro. I'm in love with that one. Yeah, so that one's a little bit bigger too. What about so Rugas? Are Rugas good? My suggestion would be if you see a gun you like, try shooting with that one. Practice shooting with that one and then be like, yeah, I'm going to get it. That way you, you know can kind of get used exactly. to how it works and how it feels in your hand and stuff like that. So what about Rugas? Are Rugas good? Yeah, Rugas been around for a long time, so definitely a good brand. But with the heaviness, you're going to get a little bit less recoil. Okay. It's going to counteract that recoil a little bit. Yes. I used to be in the military. Not those. But I still want you to show <laughs> I mean, me again because I, 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 yeah, don't, I don't come to the gun range often. What we're really worried about is gun safety as long as you know the finger off the trigger. Yeah, keep it down. Point it down range. That's, that's now I know I love the rules, but we want I want you to go over everything because I don't want to tell her you all rules. You know about me, the fake ID Cases in Virginia, body in D.C. Well, always me, that's what I get for tricking Came out on bail, commenced to ass kicking My milkshake brings all the boys to the yard And they're like, it's better than yours Damn right, it's better than yours I can teach you, but I have to charge My milkshake brings all the boys to the yard And they're like,
Yeah, I like the hair. It's a it's a smooth it's a smooth shoe. Not much of a kickback on my own. My only issue is if we have a zombie apocalypse, baby, I'm gonna have to find a bush to 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 hide behind and load my gun, my clip. Oh, okay. Well, I don't think I had no nails when a zombie apocalypse in right here. Yeah. Then I gotta ask uh, a few questions. Sorry, stuff you answered on that. Uh, so, do you have any any felonies? No, sir. Uh, any misdemeanors? Bless, Bless you. you. No, sir. <laughs> Seven years, and that's like blood now. Like this family, like I love her for real, for real. Hold on, now slow your ass down. Don't let these tears fool you. These are thug tears. Sitting in the bed, da 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 da, do 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 do, minding my business, watching vlogs. Mine. I heard it sound like a door shut in my house. Baby, I, I paused that video so fast I got up. Now, now my new my new friend here. She's still on the second floor, boxed up. So I was like, shit. That damn third floor. But I say, you know what? You got it. So I run down to the second floor. I get it. And mind you, she ain't loaded. Still price tag on her. Everything brand new. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, what's up? I'm in the living room. What's up? <laughs> Grab a knife too, just in case. Just in case people want to get the froggy. Because a lot of people be feeling froggy. 
So I grab a knife too. I turn on the light, I go downstairs. All the doors locked. I'm like, well, what the hell did I hear? I'm I'm going in closets. I'm looking at I'm looking at everything. Cause this ain't no scary movie, okay? You know what I'm saying? I ain't running and falling. You know what I'm talking about. So I'm like, you know what? Let me go and come up here and load my girl. So, um, I didn't I wasn't aware when I bought it. I didn't know until after me and Queen left the airport that this particular um Hellcat does not come with a safety on it. So um, but I do have two clips. So I got 25 bullets. These are hollow tips. So these are supposed to do like maximum damage, but not pierce through the body and then like, you know, hit something else. Um, God forbid I ever have to use it if it's not a zombie. But yeah, these are the, these were like $30 too for 25, but I got two clips and one clip holds 11 bullets and the other clip holds 13. So um, I have enough for both clips. I loaded this clip. So the, the one that holds 11, this one is fully loaded um, and ready to snap in. But since there is no safety on the gun, and I won't say the trigger is very sensitive because it does have like a safety on the trigger. Um, just to make sure like you really have to press both of them to like um shoot i'm not gonna load the i'm not gonna load this clip that actually had that's in the gun so i'm gonna leave this one unloaded also comes with a lock but the chamber basically has to be open like then i can lock it but yeah like i said really pretty gun super super small like it can fit in my purse let's see it can fit in this purse i know it can fit in this purse mm -hmm. and now she's heavy i know i should have been had one but honestly y'all i was i really was like scared because i've had a gun before it was a smith and wesson and it used to jam all the time and um i ended up like oh i don't know where that gun is i think it's mm, oh i hope that gun ain't got in the wrong hands i don't know where that gun is but anyway um well they did an fbi check on me baby and it came back proceed so the process was really easy for me um i won't say it's going to be the same way but i went and got my um gun from dfw gun range while we were at the range i shot this gun not this particular gun but they had hellcats that you can rent and shoot and after i shot with it i was like yeah i want to buy a hellcat so i ended up getting this one this was one of the um more reasonable because hellcats can be expensive this one was 625 but they had other ones that were 800 dollars um and i really like how this shoots it's not a lot of recoil um my hand isn't sore like only on the only part that sore was like right here like shortly after i um shot it and I shot 50 rounds. So this part was sore for a little bit in pink. But after that, like I don't have any like soreness in my arm or my shoulder or anything like that. And the process was super fast. I filled out a form. They ran the background check. It came back, proceeded. I paid for it. They let me walk out with it same day. So now your girl protected and y'all don't have to worry about me with my AK-37 finger gun. Any more but yeah um the reason why i decided to go ahead and get a um some protection today is because quita was telling me a story about something that happened to her at walmart um that really alarmed her and y'all know how i feel about walmart i do not play around with walmart walmart i always say walmart like weird stuff happens at walmart um and i only go to walmart for prayer counters and sometimes i'll dozy on over to the grocery section and pick up a few things but never a lot of groceries because i don't like being in that parking lot unloading a whole bunch of stuff it's just walmart is just full of like weirdos it'd be weirdos in the parking lot it'd just be too much going on so when she was telling me that it made me want to go ahead and get something because baby let me tell you when i be on that third floor and i hear noises 
my OCD won't allow me to have like stuff that don't belong in the bedroom up there with me. So having a butcher knife up there with me or a crowbar or a box cutter, it's just not going to happen because um, I'm practicing minimalism. So I really try to keep everything decluttered in my house. As you can see, if you watch my vlogs, like I probably clean up in every vlog if my housekeeper isn't cleaning. So like I just I do not like clutter i do not like mess i don't like things unclean you know what i'm saying so this can't be up in the bedroom with me this belongs in the kitchen so, yeah yeah the only thing that i will say about this is loading the clip and when i tell you if it's ever an apocalypse i'm gonna have to find me a little bush and throw them off my scent and hide for a while because loading that clip gonna take me about 10 minutes. And I give.